Wow, a quick, quick selfie video here because it's uh, Thursday evening. Well, it's almost 6.30 in the evening. I was on the computer about an hour ago, uh, and I decided to go for a late evening dip here. We're here at the pool here in Coconut Creek. Uh, they got people swimming laps, as you can see behind me. And it's just hot out today. It was like 86 or 87. The heat index was close to 90. And for some of you people I know on Facebook, uh, to mention a name, Vivian Furlong, she mentioned that they were getting more snow, possibly, up in the northeast. More snow? Say it ain't snow. Look at the sky here. And it's hot. It's so hot that you don't even see people in the hot tub. Okay, there are people in the swimming pool behind me. In any event, uh, we can look at back here. You might see a clock. It's uh, just getting close to 6.30. It's like 6.26 up there on the clock. Uh, an hour ago, I had an email. Tom, this is for you and Randy. They uh, announced uh, that the Food Babe, anybody who doesn't know the Food Babe, go to foodbabe.com. That's Barry Harry. Fantastic nutritionist, knows everything about good, healthy eating. And she's making uh, a tour. One of the cities is in Miami, Carl Gables, Miami. And it will be March 26th at 6 p.m. at a bookstore where she'll be doing a book signing for books that she's got, that she sold, best-selling author and all that. I may go. I don't feel like making the trip from here in North Broward all the way down to Miami alone. But if anybody here on Facebook or knows anybody else who would like to go to that book signing, I will drive, pay for all the gas and tolls. I got a 2015 MDX. It'll make the ride very bearable. But we know that I'd have to leave like super early because everybody knows rush hour on I-95 in South Florida, Miami, is a nightmare. It's just, that's the fact, it's a nightmare. Um, so I figure I'd probably be leaving around close to five o'clock to get a head start a good hour and a half between parking and everything. But in the meantime, it's very relaxing here. It's very pretty. Most people are having dinner now. It's like I said, it's just going on 6.30. And, uh, and it's beautiful out here. It really is gorgeous. We have a gorgeous day. I should move this way because the sun is probably really in. In fact, the sun is now in my eyes. All right. Again, if anybody knows, this is an announcement. I'll put it on Facebook. Um, let me know who wants to go. And uh, for those people up north who are putting up with another round of snow, say it ain't so. I don't believe it. And here is like, that's like a, a like an April Fool's joke early for the first day of spring. I think it's officially tomorrow. Today is the 20th of March, right? Okay. Well, I'll sign out there and uh, let you people go back to doing whatever you need to do. Keep those shovels handy up in the north. You never know when. But spring is just around the corner. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> All right. Signing out from the powder blue skies of uh, South Florida here. And uh, the nice pools that are comfortably heated, but you don't need much heat after a day of sunlight today. Bye-bye.